What's going on, everybody? How's everybody doing today? Hope everybody's doing well. Um, <laughs> if you're watching the market, um, all greens, and it's looking like we might be having a possible bull run right now. Um, but I just want to bring you guys another Crypto Hopper update video for March, um, as March just ended not too long ago. Um, I actually did turn off the buying right now because for some reason, I'm not for sure what's going on Binance right now, um, but I lost like, I would say a good chunk of money because my hopper kept making stop losses, which I'll show you guys right now. So let's go ahead and go to trade history. So I found it really weird that um, it was doing like stop losses like crazy. Like normally, and if you, if you guys watch my you know previous videos, you know I normally don't have that many, especially in a row like that. So you know that was a red flag for me, and that's when I you know automatically just logged in and you know I decided to disable it. And, you know, that's another thing I would say about this and using the robot. Um, you definitely, even though, you know, even though it's still AI, you definitely still want to check on it just in case, like, shit like this happens. Because look at this. I've never, ever had that happen on my hopper. And you, like I said, you guys have seen my hopper. Like, it's normally, you know, that, you know, we got profits here, profits there, stop loss there. Okay, bam, 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 stop loss there. So, like I said, you guys seen previous videos, like normally stop losses are every now and then. And then I noticed, you know, once the market was going, you know, fucking crazy, um, I was like, I got to go ahead and, you know, go check on my hopper, see what's happening um, and maybe possibly turn it off because, uh, you know, I didn't want to lose any more money because especially as, you know, Bitcoin's going up and everything else is going up, you know, I want to, you know, collect those profits and stuff like that. So. Uh, so yeah, I decided to turn it off. Um, I'm trying to debate when I actually turn back on. I'm probably gonna wait to see, let the market sell down a little bit, because um, like I said, it's kind of just been going nuts the last. I would say what last, almost it's always been 48 hours. Um, but yeah, so let's go ahead and get back to March. So I'm trying to load up. Like I said, March was a was a solid month for me. Um, I did switch up some settings and, you know, did use um, some different mounts uh, to trade with. So I was able to accomplish my goal as far as making $100 in a day. Um, I did that a couple of times, I want to say, throughout March. Um, and I did actually get a chance to uh, make, I think, my biggest biggest day with a hopper might have been i think i had like almost a 200 hundred dollar day where the hopper i mean look at that look at nine percent right there boy nine percent i mean it don't get better like like i said the stop losses yeah the stop losses are there you know that's another thing too depending on how long i'm holding positions i like to come in here and you know sell the position if it's holding for too much too like what, two or three days depending on how the market's going you know, if it's really stale, I'll just go ahead and I'll just sell it myself. That way, just cut my losses, you know, early and get that out the way. But like I said, I mean, if you're, you know, able to see all these different trades that are happening, I'm hoping I'm going slow enough so you guys can kind of see, you know, what coins and what signals they're coming from and, you know, the profits and stuff like that. Because, again, this thing, you know, the whole idea of using this is to basically make it a passive income. Like, you know, so if this thing is making $100, $200 a day, you know, in the crypto space, that's that's huge. Because now, now you're able to go invest in maybe other projects that you might like or they can say B. But uh, let's go ahead and check out the stats. But like I said, March, March was a solid month. Um, and let's go ahead and, yeah, see, like, the daily profits might that shit was trash so obviously my total average profits right now are freaking fucked right now because of what been, what's been happening as of late um and the signals too um it's weird like you know well, it's kind of tough to gauge off of that but there's been a change of signals i'm not going to who was it i think i'm going to turn off crypto quality signal no yeah, crypto quality signals premium. I think I'm, I'm thinking about turning them off, um, despite you know they have that one buy for a great size of profit. But as far as March went, um, they weren't doing as well for me. 
um, but then again you know like I said it just depends on what coins you have selected but you know that's a March update for you guys let me know what you guys think down below how's how's everything going for your hopper and if you guys have watched my configuration and settings um, if you guys have questions or if you you know you guys have have used my settings you know let me know if they're doing well for you um, like, I, like I said there is a seven day free trial if you haven't um, signed up for crypto hopper I'll go ahead and leave that link down below in the description but you know that's gonna be it for you know the March update for hopper um, April might be a little bit different like I said it depends on how the markets gonna you know go in the, last, in the next I would say a what, week or two because um, like I said, you know, last couple of hours have been really crazy for crypto, which is, you know, all good for me. So, again, thanks for you guys for watching the video. If you guys liked it, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up, share with your friends. And until next time, take care, y'all.